Okay guys, so welcome back to Shovel Knight. Now, I was going to choose one of these new levels to play, but then I remembered that we should probably do the Hall of Champions. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Now we need 5,000 gold to get in here. Luckily I have six. Now this is kind of a level in itself, but not as bitchy as most of the other ones. Basically what you're doing, it's kind of a maze, and you gotta light up every room. But in order to light up every room, you need to kill all the ghosts. Which you can only do by using this, uh, this little orb here. It doesn't work too well all, a lot of the time. But once the room light lights up, you know that you're done in there. So you can continue on to the next areas. Oh shit, there's a hole in the floor. I think it's between... Yeah, it's where the swords are. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. Fuck you. And we're going to collect all that shit. There's no ghost in here. But as you can see, there's a ghost there. There we go, got him. Crack this shit open because there's ghosts in here. A ghost, I should say. And it's rumored that that's all the members, like the the team from Yacht Club Games that created the the game. It's just pixelated. Hidden right there. My fucking god. Come on. There's one. I don't know how we're supposed to get rid of this guy now. In, reset the room. There we go. Okay. Now there's a secret room over here. Which we can get a whole bunch of gold and a music note. Clear. Alright, so 
so we cleared all the rooms of the ghosts and now we have to fight this big fucking guy pretty easy to do same concept as the other little ones I usually just bounce on it come on down come on down you little shit Fucking prick. Alright. Keep dealing damage to him. down here. Come here. There we go. So with that, we have completed the uh, Tower of Champions. Or Hall of Champions, I guess. Ghost Menace. Yeah. So now we can go back in there for free. Oh wait, we have to leave, come back, and then we can get, like, the special item. Alright, so let's go back in. And we're actually gonna get a little special item. Because if you remember that secret room we found, there is something in there that we are going to want, that I am especially going to want, because it's a pretty good item. Okay, so you want to come to this wall here, and pound this. Go through here, and collect this right here. Curious map. A map with a strange symbol. Perhaps it was lost by someone. And as soon as we leave this place, we're going to find out exactly who it belongs to. So, let's just get the hell out of here now. Because we don't have to come here anymore. Okay. And uh, the traveling, the wandering traveler will show up right when you leave. That's him right there. So we're actually gonna go and fight him, and he's pretty tough, as he should be, but yeah. Try not to take him too lightly. Okay, let's go. Black Knight, is that you? Why have you lured me here? Unknown. You know not of whom you speak, gardener. Get out of my way. Nonsense. Your disguises aren't and trickery won't de deter me. Show yourself or be gone. Athena, is this yet another test? Am I, am I to face this foolish peasant without even a proper weapon? That's right. Kratos. Then so be it. Prepare yourself for the Spartan Wrath of the Blades of Chaos. Oh, let's go. <clears throat> and I love the 8-bit rendition of 
Kratos' uh, theme. And yeah, he packs a little bit of a punch. No, no pun intended. So yeah, when you when you play this game on like the PlayStation 3 or PlayStation 4, you get a special boss fight against Kratos. If you're playing on the Xbox One and the Xbox 360 version, you get the Battletoads. Now I don't know what the item the Battletoads gives you, and I don't even know if there is a special battle for the Wii U. So he is fucking me up. My god. Yikes. Like I said, he is not a pushover. Wait a minute, I want to check something. I did have them all along, and I didn't use them. Fuck sakes. Alright. You know what? We're gonna go back. Because I'm not done with him yet. He may be the God of War, but I've beaten every God of War. And God of War 3 twice. So, let's do this. Almost get him down and he just like heals everything and then he gets really pissed. Well, when doesn't Kratos get pissed? Classic move right there. Meanie Incestus. It's all right. We beat him, but he's not beaten. Okay. Second fight. You gotta stay away from the bottom of the screen while you attack him. This part of the fight is actually a lot easier. As you can see, I hit the bottom of the screen. You don't die, but you take a shitload of damage. Come on. God damn it, Kratos. Stop jumping where I do. He takes no damage if he falls to the bottom of the screen. And I take fucking shitloads of damage because I don't land on the fucking platform. God fucking damn it. Oh, but at least I start here. Fucking hell! Damn it, Kratos. He's a little bastard is what he is. But he's beaten. There we go. We finally defeated Kratos. God damn. In Kratos, enough. In your hands. 
A mere farmer's tool burns with the fury of Hades. Surely you have the gods' favor. I shall call you the ghost of shovels. <laughs> okay. As you as well are a formidable ghost of Sparta. Yeah, no shit. Your technique is like unlike any I've seen. I bid you good fortune in your quest, wherever it may be. My fate lies elsewhere. Take this gift. I properly owned. If properly owned, it could uproot the olive trees of Olympus. We got the grave digger shovel. Torment him a little bit. No, nope, he's running off. See you later, Kratos. All right. And with that, we can go back to the armor. The armorer. We need something forged. Grave digger sho shovel. Where'd you come across that rock? But he's gonna fasten it into felt pieces. So he broke the shovel, but he made it into the armor of chaos. The armor of chaos, a plate of fiery fury. Collect orbs to fuel your rage. Which is kind of cool. So now we'll be able to do massive amounts of damage to any enemy that comes in our path. But I'm gonna go refill my magic meter, my potions, because Kratos is a bitch. And he's tougher than fucking nails. I don't have to sit through the song again, do I? Nope, good. Thank you. Thank you. Peace. So yeah, uh, that's basically all that's going to be in this episode. And when we come back, we're going to take on one of the new towers. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time.